What? Those are the French. You can tell oh. from the profile on the card. Hi, right, buddy. Buddy, why don't you play right over in here? Off in here, not on the down here. Good boy. All right. Does Lieutenant specify a setup they want us to start with? All right. Let's see here. And every turn we read determine initiative. Okay. Um, I think we need both maps. It's hiding from you. I think for this one. If you want both maps, we can definitely use both maps. Two both maps. It will run us out of real estate for. Uh, and we can stick with one on a learning it because. Yeah. Yeah. That's going to. Oh, here, baby. Okay, to the one player's room. Right there. Right there. Just tough. You're not just playing it on. Nor any white tea or triangle icons on a slot. I think we can handle the triangles and the teas, honestly. All ships should be placed within four hexes of a map edge, the deployment zone, with the entire ship on the map. Okay, I think we're pretty much good on that. If that is too much, tell me. I never know. Miniatures can be facing any direction. There's one thing to do. I got one, thanks. Bill? I'm doing okay, thanks. Hi. First, you guys won't sit down in the house? So you won't <laughs> accept a drink? We're very difficult guests, aren't we? Well, if I don't feed you, I'm allowed to kill you. Isn't that the rule? <laughs> Ice and fire. Yeah, buddy. All right, buddy, let's make it. During movement, any part of the ship may move through hexes occupied by another ship, friendly or enemy. The ship may not end its movement with any part of a hex occupied by another ship. Makes sense. Determining fire arcs. Fire a weapon. A player must first determine if the target is in its firing arc. These quick start rules cover two firing arcs based on the ship type as shown to the right. Uh, to determine a firing arc, the player looks at the hex on the ship where the weapon is located and compares that to the firing arc diagram at right. The player then looks at the ship on the firing area and visualizes the firing arc so now until the player can determine if any part of the target ship falls into the weapon's firing arc. The target ship falls completely outside the firing arc. The weapon can make no attack against the ship. That was a very complicated way of saying if it falls within the range, you're, you're getting it. Yeah. If any part of the ship is in the range, I mean, it's, it's in the range. It's just that. Yeah. yeah. Very complicated way. I was thinking maybe they were going to have something like drop off. Not really. Arcs. Well, all my turrets are uh, bow and stern. It looks like all your turrets are bow and stern, too. Mm -hmm. Which means we don't have to worry about... Looks like... Looks like we're standard with what you've been talking about, so... Alright, well... Ooh, I don't think I'm going to win this one. Alright. So I get to shoot first, you get but to move I first. Have, okay. So... I have 12 movement points. Right. 11... 10... Nine, eight, seven, six, 
five, four, three, two, one. Okay. All right. And it's just one ship yours in the back. Yep. Then you move your uh, your heaviest. And that would give me six to mm -hmm. enter a hexes. So I have to move two before I can turn. Yep. Okay. So. So you can turn two hex facings with down. your full movement. I'm trying to make Out. sure, like, and I mean, I've got weapons from. Is that better? Seems like that's not frying you guys. Basically, all I'm no. trying to make sure do where uh, we're on this one. Where are my weapons? They will be the ones listed with a a number of them inches, because okay. you are British. Therefore, your gun sizes are measured. So in I can fire at the front angle. Yeah, that can fire on either side. Both your uh, stern and your bow can fire on either side. So your turrets are turreted, and then you have your side weapons, which you'll have two colored dice on, short and long range. Six, six, five, four, three, those pivots from center. From center. Two. Yep. One. Yep. You know, we could take the one more. Oh, good. Okay. All right. This also has twelve, but it's got a uh, enter hexes of one. Okay. Twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, one. Okay. Nine. Okay. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Since you want initiative, or, no, uh, you take your first shots. Okay. And just do all your shooting in whatever order you want. Just do an entire ship first. Okay. So, since I got this guy and you're directly on the side, I can take you. Uh, each ship get one shot, or do you actually You can fire all, all weapons. your weapons that are eligible to fire. Uh, let's take out big dude. Uh, let's go over here to the side. So, okay, so I've got All right, three. You're using the wrong side for your small ship. Wait, that. Oh no. That's nope. You're using the correct side. Sorry. Okay, so I've got blue. Yep. Is that just? And are you you are you salvoing it? Explain that. Again. All right, you can salvo all your guns at the same size. What's that mean? It means you can link them together to have a better shot of doing damage. Let's do that. None of your guns... Okay, that's not true. Okay. Your turrets are salvable with each other. Okay. Your side guns are not. Okay. And that's one three Yeah, so you're starting with your, uh, your three-incher. Okay. Then you add your crew die. which is a green. Now why do I have the crew die? Because your crew are skilled gunners, or in this case, not skilled gunners. So it just says right there, not added. Yes. Then I moved, and you're shooting at this side, so you add a black die. Okay. And then you add a slot and die. That's because we were moving. Yeah. And you're shooting at this side, the movement band is black. And then you add one of the slot die. Okay. See, so you roll them all together. You total them up for a 12 to my 5. Your 12 to my 5 does not beat the 15 I have in that slot. Okay. So the shot either misses or fails to damage. Okay. Then you move to your next gun, okay. which is a yellow instead of a, a blue. And the 
rest of it would stay, stay the same. And that's a 20 to my 5. So that's sufficient to uh, destroy that slot. I circle it because it's there until the end of this turn. Okay. Okay. Now you can link your front and back turrets. Okay. They are yellows. So you add another yellow since they're slaved. Okay, so about, but I'm taking both. Yes. Okay. And then everything else. And this just makes a better chance you'll actually get through the armor on my side. So that's a 14 to my 1, which is sufficient to destroy another gun. It is not a good day to be this ship. <laughs> all right. And that, I believe, is all the weapons you can fire with that one. That ship should be gone. He's done with his shots. So right. do, I, do, I, do you do attack now? or do It I? doesn't really matter. Okay. So might as well finish yours. Off. Okay. So I'll go with the little guy. Go! Okay. So I have a blue. <laughs> do I go. fire both of them at the same time? I would do that because I have fairly. And then I don't get anything else bonus on that. And it's a black die because I moved. And then a slot die. Always do the slot. Always yes. the slot die. Okay, so there's those. So that's the side. Mm -hmm. And that's a 21 to my 1. Which damage is it going on that side? <laughs> well, he's starting to have all kinds of I kind of I, I, I got over him. aggressive. He brought his big ship out and I surrounded him. All right. All right, so that's everything on that. Um, the front I can do now, can't I? Yep. Okay, so that would be just the... Now, why is it, why is it get the blue and the green? What's Green is long range. Okay. So, for example, if you're shooting at my small ship, you've yeah. got a range one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. No, I'm still going off here. So, blue, mm -hmm. and that adds a green because of the crew. And that oh, no. adds the yellow because you're. Oh, no, no, no the, that's off a of blue ship. The blue because you're moving. No. Oh. I give you that. Oh. And it's still a black. Still another black. Because your ship's movement doesn't affect your aim. That's right. My ship move affects your aim. So that's correct, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. And you do 11 to my 2, which is insufficient to destroy the area. And I believe I'm out of shots. All right. Then we're going to start my shots. I'm going to start with my big bad. Okay. I'm going to slave pretty much everything at you. Okay. We're going to start with my turrets. Which one are you going after? I'm going after your big one. All right. So I got two because they're slaved. I've got crew of blue. And what is your movement band on that side? Uh, my movement band on that side is black. And I had a slot die because we always had a slot die. So, I roll a 18 to your 5. My 5 on that side is 16. So, circle it, I blew it up. Okay. Alright, then I'm going to do my side guns, which are somewhat less powerful. Instead of two yellows, I have two blues and a black, and I have two batteries of these. And, hmm, I'm going to have to re-roll one of these blues because I have crew out of the blue. So, unless someone has a D6, it's not white. Not sure it's going to matter too much. My total right now is eight. 
13 to your 2. Just got it. 12. Okay. And so okay. that took that out. All right, then I'm going to do my other side battery on that side. And that's going to be the same deal because we only have... Uh, So that is a 16 so far. Already got it. Yep. 13. All right, now I'm going to do my other side battery on your little <laughs> ship. <laughs> little ship to the, the attack back, huh? <laughs> I might be saying bye-bye to little ship soon. <laughs> and I've already fired my turrets. Those are gone, okay. so... Well, you've got some side guns. Okay, I've got a 17 before the addition of the crew die on your 2. 2, 9. <laughs> At least I didn't roll a one, because that would be a miss, because yes. you have a small ship. And I fired my right other back. battery, yep. Speaking of, it's a miss. Does not matter what I shoot. All right. Now? Now your little ship. I have my little ship. Buddy, here's your bacon. You are definitely entirely in my front arc. Okay. It does not matter. That means I can only fire with my twin linked front cannons. I am one, two, three, four away from that. And one, two, three, four, five, six away from that. I think since I don't plan on shooting your uh, your front that much if I can avoid it, I'm going to take my shots at little ship. Okay. That means that I only have a short range of four and a long range of eight. That means I get... Actually, I'm changing my mind. Okay. I'm going to shoot with my uh, at your big ship because that way I get slaved up blue die and my crew die and I don't have to re-roll things. What's your front movement band? My front movement is red. Okay. And then I have my slot die. And you're shooting my front. Yep. So, 11, 12. You've already got it. 14 to your 4. 4 is 11. Yeah. Got that. All right. That's what we've got here. That is my shooting. Now we go to the cleanup. Everything that has been circled, marked through because it has been destroyed. Okay. Next turn at this time, we can try to fix it. If you don't use your crew, you can use them to affect repairs. Okay. And none of us are anywhere near having enough uh, slots destroyed to get anywhere near structural integrity. Um, and I'm basically figuring the way it makes it is, if I'm moving, it makes it harder to hit me. Yes. If I stop, it makes it easier. Because you notice if you're moving, it's a smaller die code than if you're stationary. Yeah. I mean, I stop, you get two reds. Mm -hmm. Does that even qualify if I do one move? Yeah, any and, movement and at all. And this is just up to six. I don't yes, to, okay. you don't have to move six. I believe we are through <laughs> rolling initiative again. All right. Jeez. Wow, the initiative dice like you. They really like you. Oh, man. Well, it's my turn to move. One, two, turn. That's all that comes. So that's three, four, five, six, seven. Side is that I have half my guns broken off of that side. Yeah. Um, okay, okay. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. That would still be considered in 
it would hit your front, still be considered for my side. Oh, my ship is in your back. My, my class 2 is in your back arc right now. Oh, I know. But I'm saying, yeah. like, if that doesn't move, that would still be, because I know it will, but that would still be able to hit from the side. Mm hmm. Side, you okay. All right, so that one's moved. Yep. Two, three, four, five. Actually, I was right here. Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Not gonna matter. Seven. There is no good hold down position against your little ship. And since I killed your crew in your front, you can never repair on your front now. Oh, wow. Okay. Just FYI. Just, just for your information, you're dead. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I like that. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Done. Okay. Begin the shooting. All right. All I've got is my, my uh, stern here. Yep. Against your little one. All right. Um, and that's in the uh, front arc of my little one. So you're firing on my front. No, wait, no, no. I'm wrong. It's in the side arc. Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. So what do I got here? You got that. You know that fire truck thing that's on there? Yellow. Lots of fire truck. Now, tell me again, because I forgot. What's, why has it got the yellow and the blue? Short range, Short long range. range. You got your crew. You got my movement, which is yellow. And you got a slot die. You rolled a miss. Shoot. Okay, so that one's gone. Yep. And I don't have any other attacks with the big ship. Little ship here is going straight to your front. Yep. Okay, so I get the slot die. I get me a blue. I get me a. No, yeah, blue, because the one blue is gone. So I get me a blue. Um, to my front, you get a blue for my moving. Okay. And you're going with your three inch gun? Uh, yeah, so I actually get both of those, right? No, because that one was. That you, can slave your three inches together. I've heard that so many so that would actually be already roll a blue. And you get to add your crew to it because and I can't here because they can't be. They don't have the. You don't have anything in yeah. Okay, so I'll and I'll re roll a blue. Don't forget your slot die. Wait. Yeah. No. Yes, because that one's still there because you're firing off of this side. So you have all your guns on that side. So you're slaving your uh, your three inches together. Mm -hmm. So re-roll the blue, and let's put this back where it was. That's four. That's six to my three, which has a nine. So roll your four inch gun. All right. So it's a blue and a blue. The slot because you have no crew on your side. That should be a magazine explosion or. <laughs> Half my ship just fell off. Okay. There's that. Alright. One, two, three, four, five. Now, does it have anything, anything or rules on shooting through your own ship inside the situation? Uh, it's assumed that you drop elevation enough that you can... Alright, my little ship. 
You are in my side arc, as I planned. You're going after little shit. So I'm going to fire with everything I've got. Oh lordy. <laughs> Alright, I'm slaving, slaving all my shots together. Well, not all of them, because, well, I'm going to start with my front turrets, your short range. I have a crew, and what's your back movement on uh, your uh, big ship? Oh, big ship. Red. Yes. And my slap gun. So to a six, how does an eighteen yeah, strike you? Six is a nine. And I have one more shot just like this one. How does Two is a nine. an eighteen here yeah. Ouch. Alright, and that is all my shooting for my little ship. Okay. Alright, you are in my side arc, and I'm going to shoot at your little ship. Okay. Which is range 1, 2, 3, 4. Which puts you in short range for everything that can still shoot. I'm going to start with my pop guns. You're in short range. I have crew, so I have to reroll one of the blues. And what is your uh, side arc? Yellow. And the slot die. Do I have to keep rolling or do uh, you take four is twelve? So. Yeah. Alright, then I'm going to shoot with my turrets. And they are yellows. Which means I have to re-roll the yellow. Now this is the important part. If you have any crew that have not shot, they can attempt to effect repairs in the area where they are. That have not shot this yes. turn? I have a crew that has not shot in this turn. Okay. So on the back of your card, there is a ship repairs. It is two die red, plus my blue crew add. On a result of 14 or less, nothing happens. On a roll of 15, I repair this gun. Okay. So that is a 14, which means I failed to repair it. Okay. What was I looking at here? So every other crew has. I don't have a crew over there. I do have a crew up front. Got no damage. Got a crew under gun. I don't have a crew on the side, so the little ship doesn't get to do anything. Right. So, and then our drink ship cake and um, food on the dinner. <laughs> you killed my crew up front. Mm -hmm. um, that crew on the side, but there was no new damage. You can't repair new damage, only old damage. Okay, so I can actually try to repair on this side. So it's a green die. Okay. And the two red die. And the two red die. Fourteen or better. Yes, so you get to choose one of those two uh, repairs and just mark the damage off. So... I would personally repair your biggest gun. The 4.7? Yeah. Alright. Anything I have done this turn that uh, you... My back shot. You shot and it's just fresh damage this so you can't repair it. Nothing, so. so mark off the damage that you would uh, sustain this turn. Okay, I marked through the one. Yep. Alright, so now another initiative roll. Yep. I'll, I'll be interested. It's going to be 11 see. again. So I'm sure they'll eventually make it where you can have three players. Three. And then four. Oh, yeah. More. Sh I mean, as soon as you get more, I can see yeah. where it easily scales yeah. as big yeah. as you want. Alright. Put you back. You may start by moving your big <coughs> <coughs> Or by dying. Thursday, I was bad sick. Um, um, don't forget to mark off your uh, so-called permanent damage on the... Oh, yeah. Mark them. 
Have I destroyed anything particularly interesting, like steerage gear or uh, uh, Tesla coil trim tank? Tesla coil engine. Trim. Okay, engine okay. marks off the listed value of your movement points. Okay, so I get to take off three. Yep. Trim tanks subtract one for all your firing because you're no longer as stable. Okay, so one for all fire. Yep. Just negative one fire. Yep. Okay. Um, crew, you killed the crew. Okay, over here, anchor and plus one breach. Armor. Okay. That means if I hit you on that side, it adds an additional a point to my breach roll. Okay. Negative one. So basically the slot counts you triple if I shoot that you side. took out a gun. So, so yeah. Okay. So you can move three with your big ship. So I get three. One, two, three. Because I want that side. Let's shoot the all sides evenly. Um, all right, then I get to move my uh, point drawn. Twelve. I'm surprised Walter's not here yet. Eleven. Ten. Nine. I could see this becoming a cat and mouse game once you're down to like just a. Yeah. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. See, so he's going for my front again. I'm crossing your T. Naval tactics apply very nicely to this. <laughs> All right. So, question: If he, if you cross in front of him like that. He can move through me freely because it's assumed the captain's, unless he declares a ram, which we're not playing with those rules. In this okay. That's, you that's just kinda, slot under him. Okay. Slot that's kind of what I was wondering. You just can't stop where you would be overlaying. Okay. Um, and I'm sure they will add boarding actions, and the guy that was running the demos was talking about how they're talking about aircraft carriers already. Oh, wow. Ooh, nice. <laughs> okay, my little one still has nine. The shield helicarrier. <laughs> one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. Okay. All right. Before combat, care if I grab a smoke? Nope. I'm gonna hit the head anyway. You might want to hit uh, pause or just edit this out. Yeah. No. Or 